friends, welcome or welcome back to the channel. I'm so happy you're here. I hope everyone has been having a wonderful week. Thank you, by the way, for all the love on our most recent video. I really appreciate y'all. I'm so excited to start this series. And well, let's just get right into it. We got 500 from dad. We are doing a perfection run. So we want to make sure that we're doing all the things. We're collecting all the things. We're doing all the things. We're making all the friends. Everything. It's going to be it's going to be fun. We do have quite a bit to do, and I'm not quite sure where I want to start. Do we want to clean up the farm today? Oops, I had time freeze because right before I started the game, I wanted to make sure that I got rid of most of the stutters that come with mods because sometimes it just brings a little lag with it. So I wanted to make sure that I didn't have that coming into this, even though I see I still have a little bit of it, but it is what it is. Like I say, mod at your own risk. This is going to happen. It's fun. It's fun. I'm fun. You're fun. But I think today what we'll do is clean up the farm a little bit more. We have to get so many resources. There's actually a ton to do. And we still need to go meet everybody, which that is exactly what we'll be doing this week. It won't happen until it is the second week, right? Let's check. Yeah. So Friday. Oh, no, no, no. Excuse me. Saturday. This calendar's got thrown me off. Saturday is the egg festival, so we want to make sure that we're going there and that that's how we'll meet everybody and we'll get all of our introductions done. I don't know why I haven't just grabbed all of my tools and put them into my inventory. I'm just being a silly goose. I did find, I can't wait to show you all this trick. I'm not going to tell you yet. I'm not going to tell you until I can do it because I want it to be a surprise because I was legit shook. I was shooketh when I saw it. And I can't wait to share it with you guys. But unfortunately, it's going to be a little while before we can do it. And that is okay. Because patience is a virtue that I do not typically have. So I don't know why I'm asking other people to be patient. Let's go to Robin's. There is a recipe I want to buy from Robin. Which is part of the, the little surprise I have to show you guys. I just, I really can't wait. I'm so freaking excited. I get excited over silly little things. But with this game, with this update, there is still so much to discover. Even though, like, on my stream game, I'm in year three. And I'm still finding things. Like, I'm still finding so much stuff. I'm just going to buy everything because I would... Oh, no. And we've used all of our money. Okay, well, in that case, those paths better be worth it. But yeah, what I was saying, what I was saying first, there, there's just, there's so much to be discovered and I'm, I'm here for it. Even with like the mods add to it, obviously, like, especially because we have expansion mods in here, but it's just even without the expansions, it's, it's so immersive. There's so much to do. And for some people, that can be really overwhelming. And my advice to that is just take it one thing at a time. Don't feel like you need to get everything done at once. And you will be just fine. Oh my gosh. Also, my last video, you guys, I am I did not expect it. I did not expect it to be an hour long this should not, I was going between shall and should. I do not why, know why I would say shall. I am not a proper person. This video will hopefully not be nearly as long, but I did want to put that out there that these videos are going to be, I mean, they're going to be long because I'm trying to get, I'm trying to do a week at a time for every recording. So they are going to be a little bit on the longer side. I hope that's not a problem, but truly I, I want to get through weeks. And then that way, like I, for me personally, having a week versus like a couple of days at a time, I feel like I can get through that way better. And I can give, I'm able to give you all 
more when it comes to videos because I'm only posting one video a week. I don't have it in my schedule right now to do more. And I wish, I really wish I did because I could play Stardew all day, every day, night, morning, evening, you name it. I don't want to stop playing. I love this game so much and it's all I want to do. It's all I want to do. Let's go turn some stuff into Gunther. I'm not going to get all prim and pretty. Okay, we're going to skip this. With the museum yet, I'm just going to start. We're just going to get the things donated. And then once we have everything donated, there is an option to rearrange the museum. So we'll do that. Listen, I'm trying to talk to y'all and I'm trying to concentrate at the same time. This is not working out too well for me today, but we will do that. Why am I coming over? I'm coming. I'm walking over here like I could. Oh, geez. Like I was able, I was just going to be able to put him down. Oh, Kelly, you're such a silly goose. It's okay. Ooh, what's our reward? Cauliflower. Okay, cool. We don't have to buy any cauliflower seeds from Pierre. Actually, oh, we don't even have that much. Oh, you guys, why did I spend all that money? Oh, oh, Kelly, you silly, silly girl. That's not what I wanted to look at. We're going to have to do some of these. Can I please have that? Green slime hunter to slay six green slimes in the local mine. We can absolutely do that. All right. I can't even buy. I really can't buy anything from Pierre. We can go do that and that'll be 300 and that'll take us over at least a thousand. Oh, I can't believe I did that. I wasn't even thinking when I was buying everything from Robin about all the seeds that we needed to buy, saving money for the strawberries. Oh, hey, Willie, you'll land some good whoppers. I will land some good whoppers. You betcha. We need to go to the Adventures Guild. We have two days for this. So I would rather fish today and try to get some money that way. And I'm going to fish down at the ocean because if I can get a chest, if I can get a few chests, there is a weapon that I can get from one of those chests that I hope it would give me. I hope it would give me. Actually, you know what? These are um, Ridgeside characters. Hello, ma'am. Hope you have a good day today. Have we met them already? Hey there, how's it going? I think we might have met all these people already. Hmm. Sorry, I have a lot to do today. We might have met all of them. Oh, hello. I guess we met them. I don't know. Did we meet Olivia? I wonder if any of Victor's friends want a part-time job cleaning the house. It saved me a lot of time. I'll take it. I need money, Olivia. Caroline. Okay, have I met everybody? Did I go through this and start like talking to people and I just don't remember? That's that's a huge possibility. The way my brain functions, absolutely. That is probably exactly what happened. I'm going to do a little bit of fishing and I will meet y'all back here in just a moment. Okay. I fished until all of my energy was gone and I did not get a single chest from that fishing trip, which makes me incredibly sad. So no good weapon yet. That is a bummer. And we'll just go sell all this stuff though. And that way we'll have we'll have some monies. So we'll have some good monies from fishing. But we need more chests. We need to get organized too. Like like the chest being so unorganized is really, really, really messing with me. I'm just a very organized person. At least in games I am. Okay, let me rephrase that. I'm a very organized person in games. IRL, that I mean I'm organized, but not nearly as efficiently as I am in a game. Okay, so we got about 5,000 from the fish that we collected yesterday, so that's awesome. I did a little bit of storage, organizing, arranging, so that's going to be a little bit better. And Demetrius just came by, so we got our farm cave. I always do bats. I've seen a lot of debate on the internet, just of what do you choose, and it seems like it's a very controversial thing. What, tell me in the comments, what cave do you choose? I I want to know. I promise no judgment here. This is an absolute no judgment judgment zone. I always go with the fruit bat cave because you can get fruits way quicker and way easier. And that helps you get the artisan bundle much quicker because, and you know, in the beginning game, 
trees are tree saplings are so expensive it's ridiculous how expensive they are i think the only tree sapling i'll really buy is the apple because we need so many apples for bundles but other than that i won't buy any other tree saplings until i'm good and well a nice rich little sprite <laughs> but i want to know what do you always pick i see a lot of people picking mushrooms but i'm a, i'm a fruit bat girly I'll always and forever. Okay, so we got some farm maintenance done. We're going to go to the mines and do this quest really quick because that's going to be an extra 300 gold. We just got to save our gold until after the egg festival because we need all of our strawberries. Plus, we have to grow everything else too. We got a lot to do. More towards like the middle of the season versus the beginning of it. Oh, 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 I only have three salads. Oh, and I just used two of them. This is going to be a short mind trip. I'll see y'all in a minute. Okay, we got the slime goal completed. So we need to go talk to Lewis. It's 820. What is it on Tuesday? I don't know if he's going to be at the saloon or not, but I have absolutely no energy. We've got no food. That was rough, but we made it another five levels down. So... Not all is lost. Okay, Lewis wasn't at the saloon, so we'll just have to find him tomorrow. But we can make a furnace. And then we can also start crafting. I know I had 24, but if I used 20 more, then I wouldn't have more copper. We need to at least upgrade a weapon. Let's go level three foraging, the cookout kit, and moss soup. That's new. Level two mining. Okay, nice. We made no money today. All right, we are going to go find Lewis, get our money for our quest, and we just completed another quest. I don't think you get anything for the furnace quest, do you? No, you don't. And we have a couple more days before the festival, and then we'll be able to actually make some crops. <laughs> I guess I'll do... Uh, oh, you know what I forgot to do yesterday? I forgot to say hi to the cheeky chicks. We definitely need more wood, so this doesn't have to be a wood chopping day because we have to make so many chests in order for my organized heart to feel okay. It also doesn't help that I'm a hoarder in games, so. And then clean up the farm a little bit more, and then we'll figure out something else to do today. I'm not quite sure what I want to do. I don't want to spend money where I have to go buy more food. Okay, well, I did exactly what I didn't want to do. I used all of my energy cleaning up the farm, but we have a good, nice, big area to start farming in once we get everything that we need. I think I'm going to run to the community center and donate some stuff there. Maybe we'll have enough to complete one for something and I'll get like some food. I don't know. I guess we'll see in just a second. Okay, let's get our money from Lewis. Have I, I didn't talk to Lewis yet, right? Oh, you've been spending some time in the old community center. It's good to know someone's taking care of the place. Okay, wait. Did I get the money? I have to go back after I record to see if I got the money for that. I'm going to be really angry if I didn't. Okay, there's another quest. Someone bring me a largemouth bass. I can do that. I can do that very quickly. Maybe, hopefully. Apparently, I don't have any energy. Oh, gosh. Okay, catching that largemouth bass took so long. I don't even know why. I had to eat pretty much all of the fish that I caught just to catch that fish. All right, Abigail, take your fish. That took all of my energy, please. This isn't exciting as I thought it would be, but that's not your fault. Thanks for responding. Oh, I was like, excuse me? I'm not here to be exciting. I'm here to give you your stuff. Okay, we did get something that we could donate. So we're just going to throw that there for now. And we'll be on our merry way. Oh, we have a few more fish to sell. So that's good. Not much, but a bit. So I guess what I can do, we can just use today and forage things. Which is fine because that will give us our foraging skill and just work on that and do a little bit of exploring. Ooh, what's Andy doing out here? Let's go find out. It's not very nice to me though. I need to pick me up some food today. Question is, do I look for forage in the forest or buy something from Joja? 
Oh, I forgot, you guys. Speaking of Joja, I have not been talking to Morris, who I want to friend before I finish the community center. Hmm. I guess it's 520. I'll just go talk to him tomorrow. I don't even think I have anything to gift him that he would like. Maybe one of the gems from the mines. I'm not sure. Anything good in here to forage? This is part of Expanded. It, um expands the cinder sap forest and adds a couple new little areas to it, which are really fun. Honestly, though, it's massive. Another day down. This is going to be a quick week until we get to the egg festival. Ooh, 800 from all that? Nice. That wasn't bad at all. There were a couple of ores in there, so that definitely helped out. We'll go find Robin's axe really quick, and that's another 250. Bye, my sweet little chickies. What were their names? Viola and Piccolo. Wait, what do we name the cat? I can't remember my cat's name. Oh, Callie. Callie the Calico. Now I remember. But we were going with instruments. Maybe I should change their name to Cello, Clarinet, Clarinet the Calico. Okay. I ran out of energy so quickly. I cut down like two trees. So I'm wondering if I didn't get enough sleep. No, I should have been full energy. We'll just get Robin's axe. Oh, oh look, Andy's got strawberries already. That's not fair. Oh, I almost forgot about this. This is really exciting. Only a master of the five ways may enter. I can't wait for you guys to learn more about that. I finished it in stream. It's really cool. It's part of 1.6, and it's just, it's probably the coolest part about all of the updates. It's going to take us a while to get there, though. All right, we'll take Robin her axe. It's Thursday, so she's absolutely at home. Is there anything else we could complete for a moment? Build a silo? Can't do that. Reach farming level one? I should be doing that? Wait. No, we just have to make the scarecrow. Hold on. Hold the front door. We can absolutely do this. Look, we're done. Do we get money for that? Yes. Oh, 100 gold. I mean, 100 gold is better than nothing. We can head up to Robin's, and then since we'll be up there, we'll go into the Adventurer's Guild. Get initiated. Okay. Here is your act. Yeah, I did find it. You're welcome. Thanks for the 250. Appreciate you. And off to the Adventurer's Guild we go. Yay. We were initiated. Okay, so all of that is gone. We don't get anything from it, do we? Oh, no. Glint. Oh, wait. No, I have a thingamabobber. I have a mod. It's called self-serve. So even if they're not at their respective stations, you can still get things done. Like, you can buy things and pick things up and all that stuff. Because y'all know... We all know how annoying that is when they're not there and you're like, oh my gosh, I need this stuff. Um, hold on. I want to turn that into Gunther. Wait, no, I don't want to turn that into Gunther. We need that for the, the place, the community center. Oh my gosh, the brain fart was so real. Okay, Kelly, you're throwing away all the wrong things. Okay, yay. We got some good stuff we could turn into Gunther. Let's go do that. Donate. Let's go. We get a reward. Yay, another one. Yay, another one. What did we get? Tell me now. Starfruit, melons, and a sand and geode. I'll take it. Tomorrow is Friday, one day closer to the egg festival. Um, we're doing pretty good on saving money for the crops. Okay, so we got back up to 10k. Let's go. Um, our pleasure to inform you that your farm will be featured in next week's up and coming column of the Stardew Valley Tribune. Congratulations. We're impressed with your quick progress. Mayor Lewis, the festival starts at 9 a.m. tomorrow. Thanks for letting me know. Maybe what we'll do today is spend all of our energy on the farm again, like we have been, but kind of making this area look like a little cute farmy area. Ugh, and the traveling carts here. Gosh darn it. This is where we lose all our money again, literally the day before the festival. You know, I'm going to put a petition out there. She should not be available the day before the egg festival when you're trying to buy strawberries for the first time because she's expensive and I'm going to want to buy stuff from her. Especially if it helps fulfill the community center. Like, cheese. We could totally use that. 
a super meal, I could absolutely use that. Truffle oil, yes, please. Of course she has things that I need and that I want, and I'm not spending the money on them. I shouldn't have even came. I shouldn't even have came to see what she had because now I've just broken my own little heart. Oh, well. We'll just go back to kind of designing our farm. I kind of want it like PC, if you know what I mean. I want it to look, I don't want it to look so uniform. I want it to kind of look, not, I don't want to say a mess, but like it's sporadic. It's like, it's fun. I, guess, I don't know. Is that the right word? I don't think that's the right word. Why am I not standing in the middle trying to do this? Ugh, that's why. See, Kelly, you're, it's your own fault. You waste your energy this way. Put a little guy down here. Well, you know what? If I have the auto watering mod, oops, it's an X. I could actually fill all these in. Nope, too much, too much. But then there's like this awkward little space. No, oh, come on. Okay, I'm like actually really, I'm really vibing with this. I'm excited about this. This is feeling uber cute. I feel like this is something we're going to be able to work with. Okay. And then whatever energy I have left right now, I'm going to get wood because we're going to make fences and paths. And that literally took everything out of me. No. Um, I don't want to eat. I can't eat that fish. I could eat. Oh, my God. The dulce, dulce seaweed gives you 98 energy. And I've been selling this stuff. Oh, you goofy goober. Look at that. We can cut down all kinds of trees now. And truly, we have five copper bars. Do I want to... I know what I should upgrade, but do I want to upgrade the pickaxe or the regular axe? I feel like I've been using the regular axe a lot more than the pickaxe. Okay, I'm not going to do it this episode. So you guys tell me down in the comments, what should I upgrade? Should I do my regular axe or my pickaxe? I know that the pickaxe sh is technically the one that I should upgrade first because, you know, get further down in the mines. But if I'm working on farm stuff and I've got all these trees to cut down and all this wood to collect, I don't know. I don't know which one I want to do first. Tell me. Tell me what you think. Actually, you know what? I'm not going to do either because do you know what we need? We need a silo. <laughs> I totally forgot about the silo until just now. I totally forgot about it. Let's go see if we can make it to Robin's on time. I think we have plenty of time, but I always get scared that we're going to run out. We need to build a silo. Oh, wait. Oh, hold on. We have eight clay. Oh, we literally need two more people. Oh, wait. I have four in my... Okay, never mind. We good, y'all? We are good because I have four in my backpack. All right. Please build my silo. Oh, wait, can I not build this anywhere and build it right there? Well, you know what? I don't like it right there. Then put it right there for now. Let's go. She said, I'll start working the day after tomorrow. It's a festival. Hi, Alyssa. She's so cute, you guys. She's so excited for the egg festival tomorrow. I can't wait. Me neither because I'm going to win. Oh, another thing. I wanted to talk to you guys about is what about East Scarp? East Scarp is another expansion that would actually go really well. And then this is how you would get to East Scarp and you see like the bridge, like it's marked off by, by traffic cones. And it adds a lot more to the game and a lot more NPCs and other different storylines, which I think I feel like are really fun. Tell me if you want East Scarp in the game too. I have no problem with it. I have no problem making this game as long and immersive and all the quests as possible. I love it. I totally missed it. 
the booksellers in town. And, oh, hi, Ezekiel. It's your birthday. Eggs. Why did it have to be eggs? What kind of rotten egg comes up with a festival about eggs? Okay, let's find out what we get. No, not Blair. Okay, you guys walk past me. I need Ezekiel. Ridgeside, Monkshood. Monk's hood. Um, I have this. Hold on. Come here. Come here. Come here. Forage. There we go. You know what? I'm going to give you my silver one because it's your birthday and I want to make friends with you even though you scare me. Let's go see if he is still available. We don't even have enough money. No, don't go to the bookstore. We don't have enough money to buy the things that we need from there. They're all so expensive. Everything's so expensive. Why is it all so expensive? Yay, it's festival day. Get all the animals loved. Love you. I love you. And, oh, oh, we got two. All right, we are finally at our large egg stage. Let's go. Where is Callie? There you are, sweet kitty. Come here, my darling. All right, wood. Let's, while we're waiting, we can kind of decorate, I guess. I need a well. Hold on. I don't think I'm going to plant anything here. And we'll get the next thing we'll buy from Robin is a well. And we'll... I hope that's enough room. It should be. I don't know. I don't know what the pixels are for it. But I kind of hate that I don't have my little, my little lines. Hold on. I can't make it there. Do I want to make it there? Like that close to it? Okay, that doesn't look bad. It doesn't look too shabby. Okay, but you can't be there. Gotcha. All right. The egg festival has started. We got room in the inventory. Let's go. So with Ridgeside and expanded, the festival, I'm in prepare y'all. The festival is a lot different. So the egg hunt, don't get stressed out by me because it's way harder. It's way harder with expanded than it is normally. Normally I can run around the egg hunt and just be like, heck yeah, we're done. I got this, but no. All right, I'm going to talk to everybody really quick. And then this way I know we'll have met everyone. And then after I get that done, we're going to start the egg festival. I will see you guys in just a minute. Yay, we talked to everybody and we got the quest done to meet everyone. So now strawberries. I don't know how many I want. If there are, there's nine plots, I mean nine spots to apply and I want to do four. We'll do 36 strawberries. That should be quite enough to get us a decent amount of money. Oh, I can't sell that back to him. <gasps> Let's get a lawn flamingo, a plush bunny. Okay. Don't buy anything else, Kelly. Stop buying things right now. All right. Let's go get the egg hunt going. I think everyone's ready for the egg hunt. Let's start. It's time for the highlight of today's festivities, the annual spring egg hunt. Calm down now, kiddos. You're going to need all your energy if you hope to find the most eggs and take home the exclusive prize. Now, is everyone ready? Let's go, Lewis. You're taking forever. Let the egg hunt begin. I'm going to go like my regular route that I always go and hope. Let's just hope. We need nine eggs. We need nine eggs in order to win. Move. This is not part of my regular route, but I see it. Oh, I picked it up. Okay, perfect. Can I get back here? Perfect. Oh, no, pick it up. Where are we at? We're at seven, and we have 17 seconds. Oh, my gosh, this might be the first time that I've ever beat this. Come on, come on, 10, nine. Yay! I think we did it. I think we did it. Can I get this one in time? Come on, come on, come on, come on. There we go. <gasps> boom, boom, boom. I think I got it. Please, it better be me. It better be me. I'm going to be so mad if it's not. Look at all these eggs. If only I could get you kids to pick up litter this efficiently, we'd all have, we'd have the cleanest town this side of the gym sea. <laughs> Stop it with the bad jokes and announce the winner, Lulu. I want to get my prize. Lenny, you know this event was made for children, right? Then why do you have adults participating in it is what I want to know. 
I will not, anybody who participates in this that's considered a quote unquote adult, I will not marry because I don't know, it just feels wrong. Why are, why are they in here? So anybody in this little circle, I will never marry ever in the game, ever, ever, ever. Now the winner of this year's egg hunt. Me, it's me, it's Kelly. Thank you, thank you, thank you everyone. And I get my straw hat, let's go. But I have the forager's hat, so I think I'll give the straw hat to Callie. Come here, sweet kitty. I got a prize for you. Can I not put it on you? Oh, there we go. Look at you. You're so adorable. I don't want them all like side by side. They're kind of like having them sporadically placed. Because what did I say? I was going to do four plots. Oh, and I have an extra. Oh, I do have an extra one. That's right. Okay. But cute. We got our silo being built today. Yep. Okay, we're getting a rainy day tomorrow. Oh, we have to go see what the queen has to say. And we can go look at the travel and merchant now. And we could actually buy something from them now. So we will go do all that. Stop chopping down trees. Television, come hither. What did we learn? We learned coleslaw. Thanks. Ooh, a cutscene with Andy. Ah, it's a new farmer. How are you doing on this fine sunny day? You caught me in the middle of tending to my crops. I'm spreading some new Joja fertilizer on my crop field. I always use Joja fertilizer. It makes my crop stronger and healthier. Mm, but does it? Say, you're just starting out on Daisy Meadow Farm. I have something for you to help you out. I have some strawberry seeds for you. Fairhaven Farm strawberries have good reputation in Grampleton and Chestervale. I don't know why I'm making Andy sound so country. I'll be sending them your way once I have the time. These are here are crops that got me occupied. You get yourself a nice day. Kelly, go get some dirt on you. <laughs> okay, don't. I'm never, never again. Never doing that again. Did we get more strawberries? Oh, is, I guess he's going to send them to us. What you got for me? Watch. She had all kinds of things that I wanted on Friday. And she's not going to have a thing today. I mean, we could get the food, though. We totally we'll take no the shad's so easy to get i don't want to pay for it look what, what did i tell y'all what did i i knew it oh i'm gonna buy the food though i knew this was oh i knew this was gonna happen rude i'm gonna take that table plant too thanks oh i was like i knew it i felt it in my bones like you know when something's like gonna go exactly how you think it's gonna go i felt it i felt it right there in my core Said no goodies for you today. All right, let's go buy the rest of our crops. Oh, hold on, what's on the board? An iron bar? Yeah, no, Demetrius, it's absolutely not happening. It's Farmer Kelly. It's Rip Off Pierre. Oh my God. I spent, I had to go fishing. I literally bought nine green bean seeds and then I went to go buy some more cauliflower and I'm out of money. <laughs> Okay, I'm going to fish, and then eventually we're going to do something on the farm. One of these days. Oh, my heavens. Okay, I'll see you all in a minute. I'm done foraging. Oh, everybody's on the dock today. Hello, hello. Well, good thing I bought these these meals that I could eat. Just got 2000 off of Willie. Maybe I can get, like, another 2000 more, and then we'll be able to buy what we need. Okay, so we got we got a good bit from Willie. We were able to get up to 5,000. Probably could have gone for more, but I think 5,000 will be okay. I want to run. I hope I, I hope I don't mess up time when I do this, but I want to turn all this stuff in to Gunther really quick because, of course, I didn't get the weapon I was looking for in the chest. But I did get a bunch of artifacts, so we're definitely going to turn those in really quickly, get our chicken statue, and let's make it to Pierre's. Run, 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 little lady, run. Say move, Clint. Get out the way. Ugh, Pierre, it's fine. We have self-serve. I don't need you. Let's go start being a real-life farmer. Perfect. Yay! Okay, let's put, we're going to have to make another scarecrow. And then we'll put our other little buddy. 
right over here somewhere? No, it's something. Okay, there you go. Yay. I can't wait to decorate this more. I'm really excited. I like, I really am enjoying how this turned out. This is really cute. And we're going to have like little sporadic places like this all over the farm. And I am excited to have it look like an organized mess. I, I think that's the best way I can explain is how it's going to look. It's like, it's it going to be an organized mess, but a cute mess. It's going to be a cute one. Off to bed. We, oh, we didn't even say hi to Callie today. I'm sorry, Kikiri. Okay, friends, thank you so much for hanging out and coming through another episode. We have finished week two of spring year one, and next time we will start on week three, spring year one, the 15th. Anyway, if you are curious about any of the mods I'm using, there is a Google Doc link down in the description for you guys. If you'd like to hang out more off of YouTube, please come see us over on Twitch. We love making new friends. I stream Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, and Friday. I'm there all through the week. I would love to see you there. And all the links to my other socials are also down in the description. If you are enjoying this series, please consider subscribing and maybe like it, turn on no notifications. I would so appreciate you. Anyway, I hope you have the best rest of your time zone. I will see you all next time. Thank you again. Bye.